Hello everyone. Let's continue our discussion with blue flower or blue rose and let's try to understand its color in or its appearance in different colors. So let's assume we incident white light which is red, blue and green and we we notice that when we incident the white light on it or if we incident incident only blue light see what's going to happen is the blue rose is made up of pigments that do not absorb blue color and it absorbs red and green color so the color which are getting absorbed are not going to reach our eye so suppose the eyes over here so which light is going to get reflected blue light because blue these pigments they do not absorb blue color so the blue gets reflected and that's why in white light you see blue rose as blue only and if you even incident only blue light these pigments are not going to absorb the blue light and the blue light is going to entirely get reflected and finally reach the eye now let us impart or let us incident green light on it these pigments they absorb these pigments they absorb red and green colors so these two light are always going to get absorbed by these pigments so here we are incidenting only green light so the the pigments which are over here they are going to absorb the green light entirely so nothing reaches your eye no light reaches your eye so the appearance in such situation is black this we have already discussed and if you impart blue green and red light so as discussed that the pigments they are also going to absorb the red light so the pigments are going to absorb the entire red light nothing reaches your eye no light so the eye perceives the color of this as black again these are quite interesting cases in which we when we impart secondary color what happens so let us consider cyan now cyan is made up of blue and green so we can also mention blue and green now these pigments they do not absorb blue color but they absorb green color so which light is not going to get absorbed blue so the blue is reflected and finally reaches our eye so in cyan light also our eye sees this rose as blue let's talk about yellow light yellow light is made up of red and green so red and green and we know that the pigments they absorb red and green both colors so no color is going to reach your eye no color reaches your eye so again you perceive this as black now finally the magenta when magenta light falls on it magenta is made up of blue and sorry blue and red so blue and red now we know that the pigments they do not absorb blue color they only absorb red color so again the blue is going to get reflected and your eye perceives the color of the rose as blue in magenta light as well